What's up everyone, welcome back to Pokemon Brown. Today we're heading into the Silk Tunnel, and let's just begin exploring this cave. Repel runs off. So I guess, uh, not Potion. I'm gonna go ahead and spray another one, and we're gonna begin exploring this cave. Now if I remember back from Rage on Adventures, this cave should lead us to Moraga Town, I think it's called. Um, there is a gym there, but it's not like the next gym we're supposed to do, so let's not worry about that. Over here we need strength to move on, so we're gonna go down this ladder here. And yeah, let's not worry about what's coming up ahead and just worry about what we're doing now, which is going through this cave. I'm actually going to be looking for my next team member here, so yeah, it's going to be my fire type that should kind of help you out if you've already played this game. So here on this floor is where the trainers start and also the floor where we can find my next team member. So let's start off. Repel Wars off right in front of this guy, so I guess we're going to fight him. Now his first and only Pokemon will be a Geodude. And there we go. I know these guys like to use um, self-destruct a lot, so I put Jizz up first. I really don't want anyone blowing up in my face, so, you know, I just just a little precaution that I put up. Such a big tunnel. This guy's going to start off with a Diglett, and then he's going to have an Onyx. And there we go. Lost. No. Such a big tunnel. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't want to spare Repel just yet, because I could run into my next team member, so hopefully I'll run into him eventually, but let's just keep going right on through, and we've reached this guy, so I guess we'll fight him. It's cold in here. This guy will have a Slowpoke as his only Pokemon. And there we go, we defeated him, so yeah, I'm exhausted. Oh gosh. Um, I'm gonna try to look for my team member right now, actually, because I don't want to keep going on, so... I know I don't have a Repel up. Why aren't any Pokemon showing up? Oh, you suck. I guess I'll just fight you and keep moving along. This cave is so dirty. This girl is gonna have a Butterfree as her first Pokemon. And then she's gonna have a Venonat. And that is it for her, so crap! This cave is so dirty, stop complaining, you little whiny person. Um, wow, I am not running into any Pokemon, aren't I? Yep, I guess... Oh, here we go. And, yeah, the first Pokemon that I've run into in a while is a Ponyta, and this is the next member of my team. So it's just gonna keep using Ember, because it's actually the only move it knows right now. And I'm just gonna go for Tackles now. The fourth gym is going to be a grass-type gym. It's actually the next gym we're going to head to, but it's actually the fourth gym, so we're not going to take it on just yet, but, um, you know, I'm just going to have Ponyta just in case. I know there are some better fire types that I could use, and I know you can get Magmar and evolve it into Magmortar, because there are fourth-gen Pokemon in here, but I'm just going to be using a Ponyta this time around. I mean, it's not the best fire type out there, but I've always wanted to use one for some reason, and I've never gotten the chance to, so I think that's a little weak enough. I mean, I'll use one more tackle, but... I, I actually, by the end of this run-through, I want to have at least one 4th gen Pokemon. And, wow, critical hit, but it does not kill it, so I'm happy about that. Um, I'll try to get myself a 4th gen Pokemon by the end of this playthrough. I mean, I still have Rhyhorn I could use that I could trade for that guy, and um, I know someone told me um, you can get a Protector and evolve it, so here's Ponyta, the next member of my team. I actually don't have a nickname for it yet, so it's just not going to have one for now. Um, the nickname Raider is back in that other town, so I guess I'll go back there eventually. Um, let's go ahead and put Shocker up first, I guess, now. Not going to use Ponyta just yet. Let's build another Repel now that we're done with looking for it, so... Yeah, we're going to fight you now. I can't believe I got lost again, and I can't believe it's not Butter. Lame joke is lame. Rattata. Another Rattata. And a Raticate. Hooray. And Shocker, of course, had to die. Oh, I did my best, but your best was not enough. Haha. -ha. So, next up is this guy. Cosplaying will make me so cool. Cosplaying is not cool. And his second Pokemon will be Cubone. I cannot believe how many times Jizz just missed. And his burn eventually did kill him, so... Sorry about that, people. Um, let's go over here. Nothing over there. I don't think there's anything important. Ah, uh, there's the exit, so... I guess we'll head over here to fight this guy, the final trainer, I believe. Yes, he is, so hopefully Warwegan will be able to take care of him on his own. Oh gosh, a hiker. And his last Pokemon will be a Graveler, but I know I'm gonna die. And we're back to fight this guy once again, so now I'm healed up and ready. Now this guy's first Pokemon will be Geodude. Then you'll have another Geodude. And finally a Graveler. Yeah, I, I blame it all on hacks, honestly. I mean, Jizz kept missing and he had burns, so... You know, I, I, I blame it all on the hacks, basically, so... I forgot a spray to repel, so I'll do that right now. And we'll move on and get out of here, I guess. We've got ourselves Ponyta. We beat all the trainers, even though we died once and had to go heal up. But hey, we still got through the Silk Tunnel. And I believe we're approaching the end of it, so let's head over here. Um, I know there's some hidden items and stuff, but I honestly... I don't even know if there are any hidden items. But if there are, I'm sorry. I really don't know where they are, and I'm not going to waste my time looking for them. 
So over here is actually the entrance again. You can use strength to get a shortcut, but we're out of the silt tunnel. And ZOMG, it's a Psyduck right at the end exit. I was about to say entrance, but no, it's exit. Um, yeah, here we are in Moraga Town, or at least I think this is Moraga Town if I remember back from Region. Repel War's off, and we're in a type to you. Being in the alley can be scary sometimes. Yeah, a little girl in the alley. Uh, 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 you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. And there's that sign that we can't read from this way. I really don't know why they would do that, but sure, why not? Um, so, I, like I said, this is Moraga Town, or at least I think it is. Until I see a sign that proves it. Um, no, not you. You are not a useful sign at all. Until I see a sign that actually says something useful and tells me this is Moraga Town, I will not be happy. Orion Academy, the school for the gifted. Um, there's nothing interesting in here, but there is a pretty funny dialogue right here, so... DETENTION for, uh, breathing. I don't know if this is kind of a reference to Cool Boy Man's, like, personal life. Maybe he went to some kind of school like that. I don't, I don't know. Did I say girl's school? I'm sorry if it did, but, yeah. Um, Yugaloo City is probably the next one that we're going to, but this isn't Yugaloo, so... Head in here, this is the underground. I am not gonna go here just yet. We'll be heading there later on when we have surf, so... Uh, let's keep exploring this beautiful city that no one cares about. And yeah, I can't believe I died. Honestly, the freaking stupid hacks killing my freaking jizz war turtle thing. And here is actually the food place. There actually is something interesting here. And it's this guy. Hey, kid, like the slots? Oswari City has a nice little game corner, so take this coin case for no reason at all. So yeah, I was looking for the coin case. Um, there's actually the second gen starters that you can get in the coin. Or in the game corner, so, you know, if you want me to use any of those, you know, just just give me a holler. I'm probably not going to use a Cyndaquil, though, because I'm already using one in Soul Silver, And, honestly, I don't want to use Chikorita, either, so, you know, never mind. I'm, I'm not going to use one of those. Um, and here, there's nothing interesting, so let's get out of here. And there is actually one more place of interest, or actually two more. The first one being this right here, this um, cut bush, this cut tree, bush, whatever, whatever you want to call it. We're going to cut this down, and there's actually a house here that is very interesting, and that you're actually, well, not required to go to, but I would recommend you go to, because this girl right here is going to give you an HM, and that is HM02, which contains fly. So I'll definitely teach that to Borwegan sometime, probably off-screen. And the bush or tree whatever is back. It's the amazing Bushman. I actually did see the Bushman back when I went to San Francisco. Now this lady is the last point of interest here, and she will give you a TM. And that is TM... Oh, crap, my pack is full. You know, screw you, that TM was probably useless anyway. Yeah, it's actually a TM for... Oh, I forgot, I think it's like Taunt or something. So here's the gym. Um, it's a grass-type gym. This is actually the fourth gym, so... I'm actually gonna keep this in order and not go there yet. No one can beat her. Yeah, she's a grass-type Pokemon trainer. So I just healed up with editing magic, and yeah, like I said, we're not gonna fight that gym just yet, so... Let's head over here, and next time we'll be heading off, or not next time, but we still have some time. Yeah, screw the YouTube time limit and whatnot. So let's head over here, here's this guy, you're working on a Pokedex, Professor Tim Zane came by here. He's actually still here, and you're just a stupid guard that doesn't know about anything. He's right there, but we're not gonna talk to him. I actually haven't been catching any Pokemon, so I can't really get any of the rewards anyway. So here we are in the next city, and this is... Ah, oh, come on, stupid signs, you guys suck. Next time, we'll figure out what this is. See you guys later.